What's up guys? It is Silux once again to react to the second semi-final to the Festival de Canção songs. So these are the second batch of finalists. These have won the semi-final that happened last Saturday night. I haven't seen them yet. I didn't see the live feed of this because I wanted to do this for the video. So let's start. First one, Inês Apenas, Fim do Mundo. I didn't like that. I don't like that. It looked like she wasn't actually playing the piano, it was just there as a prop. Because the note started before she sat down to play it. But then she was playing along with the rhythm. But I don't know if she was actually playing. It looked like she wasn't. And that upsets me. Why have the piano there if you're not actually playing it? I don't know if the other instruments that have been shown have actually were actually being played live. But this one seemed seemed worse than that. I didn't, didn't like the song in general. It's sad that I'm starting on a on a down mode, but it's not very bland. I needed something more. Like her voice could have gone better. But I thought she was very subdued in her voice. Not great. Next song. I already like this one more. Johnny Shelley. And they shall you move a Portuguese guitar sound, the ukulele sound thing. It's not Portuguese guitar, that's not what that is. The ukulele sound. I like that. That was good. It's my favorite so far. Only listened to two from this batch, but it's my favorite so far. <clears throat> That was great. I love I love that that whole presentation. So good. The patients just walking through the characters. That was great. That was great. The song was nice. It's a nice good song. She's a good singer. She's been on Festival de Canção before. Her song was my favorite to win. She didn't win the Festival de Canção. It was a worse song won. And then COVID happened. So she wouldn't have gone through anyway. But she was great. That was really good. I like that a lot. That might be my... Is it my favorite overall? Everything-wise, like song-wise and presentation-wise? Probably. That was 
I think that was so u nicely unique. Not just her singing. In the beginning, she hardly appears. She's just moving through the characters. That was good. That was very good. I like that. This is weird. I like that. That was very good too. Very unique. I wouldn't say that sounded like anything else that's in your Shalom Kassan this year. It has a very unique look. Good. Good sound. I liked it. It was good. I liked it. It's a rock song. I think Shivalan Kassel needs more different types of music since all of them just sound like normal pop songs. So I like there's a rock song in there. The Punk Sportif, that band that just played, they're from the same town, town I am. So you see them at like local festivals sometimes. So that's fun that they're here in a national contest. Um, I, I liked it. I like that it's rock. I don't love it. I like it to win just because it's a rock song, but I don't love it as a song specifically. Maybe there's better songs. Maybe maybe there's better ones. I like I like that one. I like I like his voice. I like the song. It's not really my kind of music, but I like the I like the emotion in it. That's nice. That that works well in your vision. Hmm. So I think out of all of these, the ones that came out from this batch, probably my favorite one. I think was the good night that I would know. The Punk Party is great. It's a, it's a rock song. It's a decent rock song. It could be better. I think this one works well as it's a good version of the song it is. As this is just a rock song, not a good rock song. I think this is a good pop Shivala Cancel Eurovision song that we'll probably hear a lot in Portuguese radio. More than this one. So yeah, I think I think this one's my would be my favorite. Especially like this part when she's like walking through the the characters. Because like usually on these performances, the camera's just focused on the singer. This one like she's a secondary thing. The main thing is the setting. Like the camera lingers on the settings, not her. Like she's singing here. Then the camera goes to the guy behind, then she shows up behind. And that's so well done. If they manage to do this as well, if they win, if they do this as well in Eurovision, I think it would work. I think it would stand out as something a little different than just main singer in the middle of the stage. 
backup singers behind them. I think it's really good. Really clever setting. It's very good. It's great. She's a good singer, so that helps. That's good. I think that's, that's going to be my pick. Maybe even more than... I don't ever hear anymore. Even more than the... Um, Mimi Cat one. With the, like, flamingo dancing suits. I don't remember. But that, that, that had a cute, a cute presentation. But it was just, like, main singer backup dancers. And this is not that. This is something different. This is something unique. All of the other ones are just the main singer and something else. Some someone dancing and stuff. It's great. This for winning. I'll put a like on that. It's good. So the the final is gonna be when's the final? Eleven of March. Yeah, so next weekend. Next weekend is the final of the show that sell. And I think Barutinoka has a good chance of winning. Call it Pashkwal also because she's... People like her. She's great. <clears throat> Mimi Cat, maybe. I liked her. She was good. Yeah, but from this group... The Voodoo Marmalade was good. The Ukulele one. The Fence Fortif is good, but... They were barely saved by the public vote. In this semi-final and I don't think I don't think they're gonna be able to save them on the next voting but yeah Babu Tinoc might win and I, I, I think it's what who I'd see do better maybe Claudia Pashkal with her look with her like unique look of the how how she presents herself and how the the thing was choreographed it's also interesting but I think this works really well and it's very unique cute so yeah that was my reaction this is gonna be my favorite one yeah that's my review maybe i'll do a a live react to the final maybe but it's at night and i work the next day so probably not but i'll do a i'll do a, a video on whoever wins the, the finalist like then just breaking down that song and analyzing that song specifically and doing a more focused reaction on just the song, like bit by bit. But yeah, that's it. Thank you for joining me. I also did a reaction to the first batch of the first semifinals, the winners of the first semifinal, if you're interested in watching that as well. I'll link that here at the end of the video. Okay, thank you. See you later.